Hi, it's Yasmin with Century 21 Connect Realty, and welcome to a More Money Monday. I hope you had a great Monday. I know I did. I wanted to go over one thing that is really important when you are getting ready to close your loan. For you to get that famous three words, clear to close, all your documents need to be in. So when you're getting ready to closing, you may get an email from your lender stating, these conditions must be met in order to close. Please, I cannot stress to you enough, get those documents to your lender as quickly as humanly possible. Because if you don't, it could delay your closing, terminate your closing altogether, or just draw things out more than they need to be. It may be something as small as a bank statement. Send us your most recent bank statements. Well, why do they want a bank statement this late? just to make sure that you are still being financially responsible. No overdrafts, no money's coming from places that can't be identified. You need to substantiate if you are going to get a large deposit in your account because that money has to be accounted for. It could also be a verification of employment. They may send a letter to your employer saying, is this person still working at this establishment? Do not quit your job before you close. I'll say that again. Do not quit your job before you close. I've had it happen and it never turns out pretty. Number one, your loan will be denied. Number two, you will lose all your earnest money. And three, you won't have anywhere to live, possibly. So make sure you stay employed until you leave that closing table. Number three, please don't go and make large purchases. If you go and open new credit lines when you're about to close, it could change the type of loan you're getting. It could keep you from getting the loan altogether and it will more than likely throw your debt to income ratio well off. So you won't even qualify for any type of financing. So these are a few things to keep in mind once you get before you get that clear to close. These things will be required of you, so make yourself a note to keep an eye on your emails and get that documentation immediately. Sometimes when you're not able to close on time, it could actually cost you as much as $100 a day. I don't know about you, but I wouldn't appreciate having to pay an extra $100 a day just to close on my home. That's all for this evening. I just wanted to give you that tidbit of information. If you have any further questions about the home loan process, please give me a call. You can reach me at 770-771-9962. I look forward to seeing you tomorrow on a terrific Tuesday. Good night.